G'day there, everyone. Daniel Anderson here. Now, there is a new Notes powered by OneNote rolling out to Microsoft Teams, and that is the focus of today's video. So remembering that we did used to have a wiki tab on new channels that were created in Microsoft Teams, that has since been removed and has been replaced by this new OneNote experience. So that means that any new team that is created or any new standard channel that's created will get this new tab uh, called Notes that is powered by OneNote. So we're gonna take a look at that in action, how the notebook is created and configured and what happens when we create new channels. Does it, uh, how is, uh, how are things created in that notebook? So let's dive in and just step through the process here. So I'm in Microsoft Teams. Um, now let's create a new team here. So I'm just gonna create a new team from scratch. Um, we will make this a private team and let's call this, um, one note notes tab as our team name and we'll create that so it's going to create a brand new team we'll add a couple of members to it and then we'll see what this tabs experience looks like so let's just add alex uh, as a member uh, we we'll, might also add nesta in here too because we need to collaborate with both of these people inside of this team they're being added let's now close um, just let, heard a little notification to notify Alex that he's been added to that team. So let's scroll down. We're in the team down the bottom here. We're in the general uh, channel. You can see now alongside posts and files, we have notes. So that's going to now configure and getting get the notes tab ready. It's gonna create the notebook for us. Uh, and then it's gonna open up uh, that particular section of the notebook um, directly inside of Teams here. So we'll just wait for that to load. That's now coming up now. So we can see here that it's loading OneNote inside of this tab. Now, when we click on our notebook, you can see that we've got a section called General with an untitled page. So let's just call this page Welcome and we have now named the page. What about when we create a new channel? So obviously when we're creating new channels, we are going to have a new notes tab as well. So let's add a new channel. Let's call this uh, development and we'll add this channel. It's a standard channel, so that's gonna spin that up as well. So now we've got posts, we've got files, and in just a second, a new tab is going to appear there called notes as well. So let's jump back into the general channel here, and I'm gonna open up this, uh, this notebook in the browser. So it's loading here. Let's open this in the browser, and let's, uh, let's have a look at what the structure of this looks like. So that's gonna open up in a new tab. So we'll wait for that to open in the new tab. Let's come back into Teams and look at development. So you can see that that tab's now been created and we do have now a notes tab in this development channel. So you can see here again, it's getting the notes tab ready, uh, configuring everything and setting things up for this channel. Let's open up OneNote in the browser here. We can see here's the structure of the notebook. We've got the notebook, we've got the section, and then we've got uh, the page that we just created inside there as well. Let's just give this a bit of a refresh, uh, just to refresh my browser. The toolbar across the top hadn't appeared. So there we go, that's a lot better. And now you can see the, um, the appearance of our development section as well. So inside of here, you can see in the developments channel, we've got our, um, let's just call this uh, development welcome. So we've got our page. And if I click on the notebook, you can see that I've got two sections now. All right, I can navigate through the sections. So I don't have to be in the channel to access that channel section. Um, so I can browse the notebook as I needed. Uh, and you can see that I've got the notebook open now inside of OneNote, the application. So again, if you've got OneNote installed or deployed on your desktop, you can open up OneNote and you can interact with OneNote as we normally would uh, in the application itself. So let's jump over to the development section. And what we'll see here also is that page uh, will appear in this section. So there's our development page and we can interact and we can uh, collaborate in here like so. And then that will be reflected obviously in uh, live and um, in sync with the notes inside of Microsoft Teams as well. So there we go, the new notes experience powered by OneNote inside of Microsoft Teams 
creates uses the uh, the notebook that's part of the, sh- the the team itself. So part of the the group connected SharePoint site that sits in the background. Each channel that gets created has a notes tab that becomes a section of that notebook. So the entire notebook is associated to that team. Each channel is a section and we can interact and uh, collaborate inside of OneNote in the browser or in the application or in Microsoft Teams. So I hope that brings you some value today. The new notes tab in Microsoft Teams rolling out as we speak.